YouTube, what's going on? It's NW Misha here with another video. And today, what I'm going to do is show you guys everything I've done to my car so far. Uh, hold on, for the past, since last June of 2018. So I bought this car um, for pretty cheap. It was like $3,100. And so far, I mean, I've just been doing a lot of things now show you guys everything that I've done to it so yeah let's get to it all right right off the bat first mod I've done was getting new headlights and taillights um, I didn't decide to get these ones but my dad was kind enough and bought me some new taillights and headlights the headlights are supposed to have halos and the taillights are tinted, um, which they're also kind of messed up. I need to fix this one. This one's the one that's broken. So yeah, like I said, the halos on these headlights don't work, but um, I'm going to be making my own retrofit uh, halo lights for them, and there'll be a, a video for that. Um, next mod I did was this little lip. So I have the stock bumper on my car and, you know, just making it a little bit more aggressive. Um, also, another mod was putting it in the tow hitch, my license plate, and getting this black trim in the front. Um, <clears throat> I got these rims. Well, actually, these came with it, but I, I got new tires for them. Um, and I decided to uh, spray paint them by myself with some of my friends it's been like this for a few months now but might buy myself some new rims or either respray paint these into a bronze slash gold color but currently I'm thinking of buying some cheap ones uh, let me know if you guys want me to either make some rims uh, custom paint them or I should just buy some better ones because I don't know about you guys but I'm really feeling like these rims are not the best for this car and I could definitely get some nicer ones. All right, next up, we would have this little lip spoiler along with the shark fins on the top. I've uh, tinted um, my windows, or actually I paid to get them tinted. Um, and they're okay, uh, they're not the best. They're at a cheap place and a little bit bubbles here and wasn't even done all the way over here but I think over time would be fixed I think the biggest mod that I've done was my own custom exhaust I'm not sure if you guys can see it in there oh there we go um, this was $30 and everything else was done by my friends and I and we decided to do our own welding because our friend had a welder and our own cutting and just it somehow worked and for 30 bucks I am not complaining this whole car if anything is a just a ginormous budget build but as we go inside we'll see this is my daily driver so um, it's not gonna be the best so the first thing we got is the short shifter um, right now it's not super short because I don't know what happened, but basically eBay, uh, I don't know. It's, it's not as what I was expecting it to be. When I first got it, it was very short and it was nice. But now after a couple months driving, or maybe like a month, it has been doing super well. Um, but yeah, uh, next thing would be the stereo, uh, my girlfriend got this for me for Christmas, and I bought this side piece, which makes it so there's no other holes and stuff like that. Um, it makes everything much nicer. Um, also got the cup holders here, because um, the stock ones are not great. Not great at all. Alright, so some things that we did to the engine, and when I say we, I mean my dad and I because my dad's a G and he knows what to do about this thing so first thing I got one of the first things was probably this um, I got this from a friend he used to have a 540i 
but uh, it was crashed so this was something that was left and I was able to put in my car um, my engine is the M52 so the, it's the 2.8 liter so my car is the 528i and you know some people some car be or car people or BMW people may be thinking like oh why are you modifying the 528 I mean like cut on so all I can get this is the only car I was able to really afford um, but yeah so some things we have done to the engine is uh, got some new coil packs spark plugs uh, head gasket I mean not head gasket valve cover gasket um, mass air fluid sensor um, is also uh, new um, I had a vacuum leak a while ago and I had my mechanic fix that also have the uh, coilovers some really shitty $200 coilovers from eBay I haven't put in my rear ones yet so I might make a video on that if I get spacers I'm definitely gonna replace the rears uh, I have replaced my secondary air pump which once in 2020 um, Washington State says that they're going to remove emissions so I'm not even gonna need that I'm gonna remove it um, but yeah engine wise I don't think I'm gonna do anything else to it I don't want to push it to limits um, if I really wanted to I could get a tune but it's kind of a waste of money for me and keeping it daily is all I really need But yeah, that's basically it for my car, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And as always, I will see you guys in the next one. Peace.